Anyone remember when we had a food hall? Heading to the mountains? Here's some advice in two words. Hot cocoa. I tried climbing the mountains, I scuttled right down on my butt. Hey, Silence, these towers we're building, did they have them in the old world? That's right. People back then used them to broadcast their opinions. From what I've been able to gather, Everything sucked. The old world sure sounds strange. Indeed. I've dedicated my life to understanding it, as well as the evil that destroyed it. So this evil... Can't we just talk to it, you know? Explain that eating the world is wrong? As a student of history, I can tell you that the try-to-get-along-with-evil strategy never works out. Besides, the punch-evil-in-the-face-really-hard strategy is so much more fun. to your head. Oh! Ooh, got my own personal swimming pool. Thanks a lot, gravity. Down. <laughs> 
fancy uniforms. Damn! A non-believer! Whoa! This thing's powerful! You should have stayed home! Oh! Oh! I pack my scarf! Uh, anyone order a big bang? Uh. Aloy silence, Aloy silence. Places found to build towers here? Zilch. A pity. But there are many more mountains to explore, and each one brings us closer to finding the Thunderjaw and the metal flower lodged in its digestive tract. We'd be even closer if you were out here actually helping. As it happens, I've been busy decrypting the signal from Helis's focus and have just intercepted a most interesting transmission. Which is science speak for we can snoop on him and his crazy cult? Precisely. Patching it through to you now. Oh, son, you're so warm and giving. Soon the whole world will worship you like I do. Huh? I told you all! You see any clouds, you shoot them down! Clouds are ah! this world. She's making it in the sky. They cannot be shot Buzz, how nice of you to drop by completely out of nowhere. Again. You spend too much time in horizontal position. Yeah. 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 You knew how important Sunday it was to me when we met, and I told you I deal with that redhead. Forget the girl. You must find more machines and more fuel. Fine. Just don't forget our deal. Sun everywhere all the time. You are a whiny and annoying human. I'm annoying. At least I have an inside voice. Ah, oh, son. Alone again at last. Whoa. Not exactly best buds, are they? And while that is very sad, I'm more concerned with their immediate plans. More fuel could mean further destruction of nature, and with more machines, that ancient evil jello creature may become unstoppable. We can't let that happen! That's why the old world disappeared, isn't it? That... Uh, thing! It used machines to destroy everything! You know, Elizabeth could really have explained things a bit more clearly. Maybe it's not too late to ask her. I said hi.
I'm getting the hang of these. Good work. The signal is getting stronger. Keep at it, and soon I'll be able to locate the Thunderjaw. How come you care so much if we find it? You are not alone in your quest to save this land, Aloy. Comforting and cryptic. I'll take it. Elizabeth, I know you're just like an ancient message and you can't hear me, but I have so many questions. Like, why is it my job to save the world? Who's my mom? Where do all the machines come from? And why are they so me? Command machines recognized. Oh, hi. So you want to learn more about machines? Of course you do. Curiosity is in your DNA. Huh? Machines were built to make the world a better place, to help people, make their lives easier, even look after the environment. But the ancient evil I told you about corrupts them, turns them against us and against nature. So be careful out there. It is the red monster's fault then. <sighs> but I still don't know who's building them all. Perhaps not. But I've detected a large pile of broken down machines in the mountains. It could be some kind of graveyard. Hmm. Good place to find some parts. And maybe some answers.